I'm here in West Kelowna. I'm at the Quailsgate Winery. They have a wonderful orchard here overlooking the lake, of course, Lake Okanagan. And you can walk around the orchard and then they also have a beautiful restaurant. I'm gonna check out the Old Vines restaurant. And yeah, just looking forward to it, so come along. I started off my winery visit with lunch at the Old Vines restaurant. To drink, I had the red wine tasting flight, which included a selection of Quailsgate wines, Rosé, Pinot Noir, Merlot, and Old Vines Fock. For an appetizer, I had Rangeland Bison Carpaccio, and for a main, I tried the Farmcrest Chicken Supreme, and dessert was a raspberry gâteau. Okay, let's see what kind of grapes these are. These are the Sauvignon Blanc. Oh wow, look at the color on these ones. Definitely more goldeny in color. And there's even more up on this hillside here. I'm gonna cross the road when it's safe and see what's over here. Ooh, so these ones are the Chardonnay. And again, they all look pretty similar, but if you compare them closely, I think that's when you can tell what the difference is. I got freedom. So just over there is the Vines restaurant where I had lunch and then over here is the wine shop. The volcano is long gone but the soil is still active. 160 acres of incredible soil we call home sits below the extinct volcano of Mount Bushuri. Its deposits work like a time release capsule combined with warm summers and mild winters. Our volcanic rocks have decomposed and recombined into soluble molecules that are easily separated into their elements and accessible to plants. Oh, this is probably the one I tried. This rosé 2022 because the description looks the same. So that's $22. So I didn't end up getting anything from the wine shop, but they did have um, the wines, like the wines that I tasted. If you enjoyed any of them, you could go get yourself a bottle of that. I think a lot of them are in like local liquor stores and stuff like that. So you don't have to get it here, um, but I'm not sure about the price if it's cheaper here or not. They also did have a wine tasting. I think you can get four of the like estate kind of wines for $15. But anyway, I didn't end up buying anything in there, but they do have some cool stuff. You could do a little wine tasting there if you just wanted to um, try a few glasses and stay out on the patio or whatnot. All right, that's it here for my visit to Quailsgate Winery here in West Kelowna. It's one of my favorite wineries. We'll see you later. <laughs> Bye-bye. See the light at the end of the tunnel. It's right there, now just look up and follow Take one step at a time, babe, I'm with you